Toys to Life is a video game feature using physical figurines or action figures to interact within the game. These toys use a near-field communication NFC, radio frequency identification RFID, or image recognition data protocol to determine the individual figurine's proximity, and save a player's progress data to a storage medium located within that piece. It is one of the most lucrative branches of the video game industry, with the Skylanders franchise alone selling more than $3 billion worth over the course of four years. Toys to Life games generally use a third person camera view and have in game power up figurines. Toys to Life games generally have an accompanying portal device that is used to transport the figurine's character and associated player data into the game. The figurines can be transferred from each game in the franchise, possibly resetting with every different installment. Ongoing Skylanders 2011 present Skylanders 2011 is one of the most successful early games of this genre. Since its first release, each year has seen a new installment in the series, totaling six as of 2016. Each game has its own portal device and a different take on the premise than past games. They star the Skylander heroes and the evil antagonist Chaos. All current figurines are compatible with its most recent installment, Skylanders, Imaginators 2016. Topic Amiibo 2014 present Amiibo 2014 is a toys to life platform primarily based on Nintendo properties and characters as well some third party non Nintendo characters like Pac-Man Mega Man Sonic the Hedgehog Ryu and Cloud Strife that have appeared in Nintendo games Launching in 2014 with figurines Nintendo has since also deployed Amiibo compatible playing cards with plans for other media in the future Unlike most other Toys to Life series, Amiibo does not have games dedicated exclusively to the use of the toys, but the characters are used throughout various Nintendo games. Amiibo toys can save players' progress data and information per game. They have even released plush toy Amiibo for Yoshi's Woolly World and Poochie and Yoshi's Woolly World, as well as cards for Animal Crossing, Happy Home Designer and Mario Sports Superstars. Topic: Starlink Battle for Atlas 2018. Starlink Battle for Atlas 2018 is Ubisoft's first step into the waters of toys to life business. The game doesn't require use of the toys to be played, but the gameplay is enriched by using them. The interactive toys consists of three categories: one, ships; two, detachable weapons, gadgets which attach to the ships using magnets; and three. Pilots the game characters. The game is being developed by Ubisoft Toronto. It is scheduled to be released on October 16, 2018, for the PlayStation 4, Xbox One and even for Nintendo Switch which will get its own special Star Fox Starter Pack Edition, featuring Star Fox hero Fox McCloud and his Arwing ship as a Nintendo exclusive add-on. Right now there are four pilot packs, six ship packs, four normal release packs and two store exclusive ships, Scramble, Smith's Toys UK exclusive and Cerberus, GameStop US, four weapon packs, and Mount Co-op packs for each version announced to be released when the game launches and more to be released at a later date. Topic. Discontinued Topic: UB Funkies 2007 to 2010. UB Funkies 2007 was the first game of this genre. It was discontinued in 2010 and was worked on by Mattel, Arcadium, and Radica. It had multiple updates before it was discontinued. Almost every update had a portal, also referred to as a hub, with the same mold but a different pattern. The hubs were a special USB port to plug into your computer. The characters were the Funkies, which each unlocked new in-game areas. Topic: <laughs> Disney Infinity 2013 to 2016. Disney Infinity 2013 is a toys-to-life series based on Disney characters and franchises. 
Since the initial game's release in 2013, there have been three installments. Disney Infinity was the first game, focusing on classic Disney and Pixar characters. In 2014, Disney Infinity, Marvel Super Heroes was released as the second game, which focused on Marvel characters and properties. The third game, 2015's Disney Infinity 3.0, centered on the Star Wars franchise. All Disney Infinity figurines can interact with various games in the series. The line concluded in 2016, when Disney announced that production of the series had officially ceased, and that there would be no more future titles. Topic. Telepods It is only used for Angry Birds mobile apps such as Angry Birds Star Wars and Angry Birds Go. Topic. Disney Playmation 2015-2016 Disney Playmation is a longer range approximately 10 meters networked interactive role-playing game with wearable toys that supported BLE communications with phone apps. The product was sold in collaboration with Hasbro. The single product storyline delivered was based on the Marvel Iron Man universe. Other universes announced before the produced was terminated included Star Wars and Frozen. Topic: <laughs> Hero Plug and Play 2015-2016. A Toys to Life game made by Jack Pacific. It is a console connected to a portal connected to plugs which you connect to your TV. You place the figures on the portal and it goes to your game. It was short-lived. Due to poor sales, there were three themes released, DC Super Heroes, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, and Power Rangers. Topic. Sick Bricks 2015. A game by Spin Master with Lego-compatible figurines and builds. The game takes place in a small town called Six City, which is under fire by a villain named Omega Overlord. Various heroes fight against him, and his goons combining with each other to fight them off. There were various multi-packs and special blind bags containing the toys. While the game itself was free, the additional figures would cost money. There were only three waves of figures, all of which were released in 2015. Following the third wave's release, no additional information about the series was released, and it was assumed to be discontinued. The line was based on a 2015 cartoon series of the same name. Topic: <laughs> Lego Dimensions 2015 to 2017. Lego Dimensions 2015 is a Toys to Life game that uses physical Lego figures, featuring characters from various Warner Brothers franchises and other third-party intellectual properties such as Back to the Future and Sonic the Hedgehog. Players must physically assemble some figurines by unlocking the levels in-game, which shows them the building instructions on-screen. Almost all of the figurines, and the base portal, have to be built by the player. No sequels were released, with the base game supporting all available figures. On October 23, 2017, Warner Brothers. Officially announced that they would not be developing further content for LEGO Dimensions. <laughs>